Softube Vocoder is an audio effect. Let's take a look at how to set up your DAW to record audio and MIDI regions while using Vocoder. The MIDI tracks will control the vocoder's internal carrier synth, while audio from your microphone will modulate the amplitude of the vocoder's 20 bandpass filters. In Logic, start off by creating an audio track. I'll rename it Vocoder Microphone. Test to make sure your microphone track is set to record audio. Let's also create a software instrument. Look for Softube Vocoder under MIDI Controlled Effects. We will name this track Vocoder MIDI. Next, record and enable your Vocoder MIDI track so we can record our performances as MIDI regions. Under Sidechain, select the input that corresponds to the mic input so that we can monitor our audio through Vocoder. If you are performing chords on a MIDI keyboard, you can click to turn off the transpose chord feature. Hit record and then record your audio and MIDI regions. When you are done, go back to Sidechain and select the audio region that you would like to be the modulator for the built-in carrier synth in Vocoder. In this example, we called it Vocoder Microphone. One last step is to mute your original source track so you do not hear the dry signal. Hit play and you will hear all of your audio through the vocoder MIDI track. Let's take a look at Ableton Live. We will rename one of our MIDI regions vocoder MIDI. And let's rename an audio region vocoder microphone. Delete the two tracks that are unused. Let's test to make sure we can record our microphone to the audio track. Let's now insert the Softube Vocoder plugin on our audio track. Now go to your Vocoder MIDI track and set the output to the Vocoder Microphone audio track. Record on both tracks. Make sure to turn on your monitoring for the audio track to hear your signal. Once again, if you are playing chords, make sure to turn off the transpose chord feature and then hit record. When you are done, just hit play and you will hear all of your audio through the vocoder microphone audio track. Now let's take a look at how to set up Pro Tools. We will create an audio track called vocoder microphone and a MIDI track named vocoder MIDI. Once again, test to make sure you have everything set to record the microphone properly on the audio track. Insert Softube Vocoder directly on your audio track. On the MIDI track, set the output to the Vocoder Microphone audio track. Record and enable both tracks, and again, turn off the Transpose Chord feature, and hit Record. Just as in Ableton Live, deactivate your Record Enable, hit play, and you will be able to hear your entire performance. Download and demo Softube Vocoder today for use within the DAW of your choice.